the inspiration and everything for your art definitely still has to come from you. Like a computer can't come up with that for you. Um, it gives many more ways to actually make it happen. Certainly the ways you control typography and get the, the text and image to blend, um, huge advantage. She can make art more accessible to people because not everyone can go to a museum, not everyone can go look at everything that's available to us, like here at UFM or in Ann Arbor. You're too connected to the thing on the screen and you're kind of looking in this little thing and you're using that to look outwards it's a bad for me it's I think it's been able to make me a lot more um, inspired and creative because in the world of like mixed media it makes a lot more things possible through um, do you want to get specific um, I think in terms of yeah. science illustration and education it can be a distraction I think that we have analog forms pre-digital forms of connecting with people and with material and meaning making that I think uh, connect with the human spirit on a, on a way that digital stuff just doesn't. And I sometimes wonder if that's like a poor surrogate for actual uh, intimacy, actual conversation, actual touch, actual sound, as opposed to something that's synthetic certain aspects, like you lose kind of an organic feel or a natural feel that maybe is more present in something that's made by a human. But on the other hand, you can create things that you could never create if you were like just a human using a tool um, or like an analog tool.